It don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? My hair. It don't move. My hair. Whoever lied to you that you have to relax your 4C hair for it to be this sleek. First of all, you're going to avoid this glue by all possible means. It's not going to give you the sleek that you need. I know it works, but it works on a different type of hair, not a 4C hair. These are the ones to use. The freeze spray and the spiking glue. That's all. So I'm gonna start by parting my hair into three sections. My hair, it don't move, it don't move. My hair, it don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? My the next bit is going to be mixed, ma making sure my hair is moisturized. And the product I use is the normal hair conditioner I mix with water in an empty bottle. You can get this empty bottle in the shops or the stores. It don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? My hair, it don't move. My hair. It don't move. Then I just go over and comb it. My hair. It don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? My hair. So the rest part is uh, sometimes I opt for clipping. And sometimes I just want to use any hairband. And in this instance, I'm just going to use my hairband. It don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? My hair. Okay, the next beat is going to be quite challenging for me, but I hope, I hope you get the hang of it. Since I'm going to clip my hair from behind, I'm just gonna go ahead and use my glue to gel it down. My hair, my hair, my hair, it don't move. My hair, my hair, my hair, my hair, my hair, my hair, my hair. it don't move. Yo, 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 yo. Before I remove the hairband, I'm just gonna apply the gel on top. My my you have to be really generous with the gel, mama. The next step is going to be really interesting. This is the spray bead. If you want good results, you're gonna to have to be really generous with it. It don't move, it don't move, my hair. It don't move, you don't move, my hair. It don't move. Then you take your brush. Okay. It don't move. My hair. My hair. My hair. It don't move, yo. Okay, before it dries up, you're gonna have to take your wrap and tie up your hair. You let it sit for between 10 to 15 minutes and check if it's dry. So let's take this off and see our end result. Let's see. Oops. Okay, that's meant to happen. Don't worry about the white stuff. I'm gonna take it off. Shut up! <laughs> Let me take off the white things using a shin spray. Oops. Guys, hold on. It don't move. My hair. My hair. My hair. Depending on what you like, you can stop at this. 
or you could add an extension so I have my extension right here and I'm just gonna hook it on, hook it on camera and that's it like your work is done <laughs> darling <laughs> darling <laughs> guys i did it i did that i did that i did that my hair is not relaxed i did that so i have an update this is my hair on the third day i can already feel some itchiness because my scalp is dry my hair is not moisturized at this point right that's why i can already feel some itching so it's not good to leave it for way too long but if you want to leave it yes you can do you can go ahead and do that should you have any questions leave, make sure to leave them in the comment section until next time have a moment of your choice Achibre.